Hi there, students. NIMBY. A noun. NIMBYism. Okay, NIMBY itself is an acronym. An acronym means each letter of the word stands for a full word. So, in NIMBY, not in my backyard. Not in my backyard. Okay, this is where um, people are complaining or strongly against the um, building of a development in their area <coughs> because it's near them and they don't want it near them. Although, if it was built somewhere else, um, they would tolerate it or support or even support it. Yeah, so um, I I understand very clearly that we need prisons. Uh, prisons are very important, but not in ba my backyard. So don't build the prison where where I live in my district. Build it somewhere else. Um, we all need um, renewable energy sources, and wind turbines are fantastic. Ah, yeah, but if you're going to build wind turbines in near my house, then don't do it. No, I protest against it. I protest strongly. And this is the idea of NIMBY. Yeah, it's... Um, Supporting strict land regulation, strict use of regulation of the use of land, and protesting against something because it's happening or it's going to be constructed in your area. Yeah, and these people are um, against having it near them. Yeah, they don't necessarily think the concept is a bad idea, but they don't want one near them. Um, so yes, yes, we we all need electricity pylons to carry uh, the power all up, um, electricity all over the land, and I strongly support that. What you're going to build? A set of power lines uh, uh, 300 meters from my house? No, no, I protest. I'm going to protest against this. You can't do that. And this is the idea of NIMBY. Don't put it near me. Um, the implication is I support uh, this, the idea of this being done, but I do not want it constructed near me. Okay, so, yeah, NIMBY, not in my backyard. A person who does not want something unpleasant to be built or done near where they live. And there are various um, examples of this. I quite like one from my hometown, Oxford, where they wanted to uh, put a... Um, a war memorial to the people who fought in the um, the the in the Spanish Civil War in the uh, international brigades, and the first proposal was in the city centre, I think, in Bond Square, and. Uh, there there were uh, complaints about this. You can't put it here. Um, so they thought about putting it in another place near the centre in St Giles and uh, there were still complaints, you can't put it here. And finally they, they decided to locate it in South Park or South Parks um, and there were still complaints about that. Apparently there was one Liberal councillor who objected to all of the, pos the, the places to locate it. But, in principle, she was not against the idea of a memorial to the interna the people who fought in the international brigades in the Civil War. Okay, that's just an example of it. So, NIMBY, NIMBYism, uh, an acronym to say, don't build it here, I don't want it done here. Yeah, not in my backyard. Um, formality. 
I think I'd probably give this a five in formality. I think you could use this anywhere, informally and formally. Although I think be careful because I think maybe a there are quite a few native speakers who might not know the meaning of it. I'm not certain about that. So there you go. NIMBY. NIMBYism. He's a NIMBY. His NIMBY attitude is so annoying. Yeah? These NIMBYs, they, uh, they, they only look out for themselves. They don't ever think about the rest of uh, society. Yeah? So, yeah, we're going to call, we're going to call these people NIMBYs. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. NIMBY.